What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Cassandra Lee. Yeah, you know me, and if you don't know, now you know it's about to go down. We are heading to a rehearsal for this film that I'm in where I play a cop. Is it believable? Is this, well, it's not a real gun. But I'm gonna play a cop, we're gonna rehearse this, and I'm taking you guys with me, and then afterwards we have a meeting, and um, it should be fun. You guys ready? Give this video a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and leave some comments down below. Let's go, have some fun. I know you guys are used to skits, but you know, I figured a lot of stuff is happening in my life, and you guys got me to this point. Every single one of you watching this got me to this point. I just wanna say thank you, and because things are getting a little bit busy, a little harder to create skits, I'ma still do them, but I'm also gonna start taking you guys around and so you can see what I'm doing on a daily basis so I can keep this connection, because I don't wanna lose this connection. You're important to me. You guys are so important to me. So, I'm gonna take you with me. Let's do this. Hey! You ready to go? Yes, I'm ready to go. We're here. We're gonna do this rehearsal. I'm excited. There's the, some of the cast I haven't met yet, so it's gonna be a good time to meet everyone and get our lines, build some chemistry. I'm excited. <laughs> I'm like living my dream, yo. This is just, it's just crazy. So I'm just excited. I'm happy. Oh yeah, you went over your lines so many times already. I know you're ready. <laughs> but are they ready for you? I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's go bring it. So that's a wrap on rehearsal. They wouldn't let us film, but I'll tell you about it. It was good. We did some lines. We built some chemistry, talked about dates, because, you know, we're not filming in L.A. We're filming in New Jersey. Um, but it was good. But now your girl's really hungry because, you know, she needs to eat. And when she doesn't, she gets cranky and gets hangry. And you guys don't want to see that side of me unless you really do. Oh, my God. I'm just kidding. <laughs> 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 let's go eat. Yeah, yeah, no, that's what's up, though. That means I get to eat, too, right? No, you're not invited. What? They are. Which then, I guess, means you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> let's so, do it. So, let's show you guys what we about to eat. Hey. Oh, Seth. Here we go. So, this is an elevator in the this house. Is, this is one of my favorite spots in LA. I haven't been here in so long, but I couldn't help it. And I promise you, I'm still going to take you. You should have just came with me today. Where are we? We're at Mama's shelter. Hey! <laughs> it's a fun, it's a vibe. Oh, we saw that. That was good. Yeah. So the eyes light up, right? When you took that bite, like, oh. So the guacamole passes the test. It sure does. Ooh. That's wow. Cassandra proves this message. Okay, okay. And what is that message? That the guac here is slamming. Slamming! So 2018, I'm working at this competition show. Four. Yeah. And I'm watching it. And it was the first time that I felt like in a long time, like I wish I could do this. Not that it was like I want to do this. I didn't think I was capable. Right, right. Like, like I wish I had almost like a fantasy. Yeah, I yeah. wish I had the I would kill it if I, if I had. I remember feeling that. And then I remember like meeting friends who were also in music, like that, that were doing audience work. And I remember one time I came to set and there was this new girl there who was her friend. She was like, oh, this is Cassandra. She is also in music. And I was like, no, I'm not. Like I'm saying this in my head. She's like, she's going off. Cause I'm just also music. See, they just thought music. And I was like, no, I'm doing skits. What? Like, yeah. no, I, I didn't think I was doing skits yet. But every time we had a conversation, I always talked about acting. I not once talked about music. Right. But you know what would happen? And you know this, and anyone who knows me knows this, is when there's quiet time, I beatbox. Yeah. So that's what I would do. And so I don't know if she thought I did music. I don't know how, if that's why, but she was like, aren't you like a producer or something? Aren't you Aren't you an artist? Don't you do something to music? No. Right. I don't do a single thing. In, I was in music videos, exactly. And I just thought that was so ironic. And I kept going like, every time this was happening, I was always going like a, huh. That's what I kept doing. Huh. You know? Yeah. And then now I'm on The Voice. I'm working The Voice. And I remember I, I had a friend who was a dancer. Her friend was there. She's like, oh, this is Cassandra. She's she's an actress. And then, and then are you in music? And it was still this suggestive, people kept doing it. Right. And I was just like, what the fuck? What? No. Like, why is, where's everyone getting this? That wasn't even the direction like, that you were at headed. At all. Yeah. It wasn't in my mind. Fast forward to me meeting Carly that same year. She tells me for some reason her her mom has a music studio that we have access to. 
And I'm like, oh, I don't do music. We get into deep conversation and I break down this entire story, but like from what I told you in the car, like from when I was a kid and how I like got beat up emotionally with the idea of right. being an artist, you know? And I explained this to her and I started explaining to her about this period of time. I started explaining to her about these friends and there's this weird, suddenly like, I wish, you know, feeling, all these things kind of happening to you. Yeah. And then your mom has a music studio. I really feel like I'm being old to try something in music. Yeah. And I admitted to her for the first time in that moment. And so now fast forward to 2019. She reads me a poem of hers, and she also admits that she had the desire as a child to be a songwriter, but never pursued it, never thought she could. She had a childhood desire, yeah, and it went away. And she, now she writes poems, and that's kind of a way. Now she's starting to write them again. So she reads me this poem, like, this could be a song. So we spend one night in the summer of 2019 taking one of her poems and turning them into a song. And then she's like, yo, you could actually sing. And I'm like, no, I can't. And I really could. And like, I really, really could. Like, nah, you always could sing though. No, like I vibe. I'm not. Right. I don't like sing. Like I'm not a singer. And you... So she tells me this, and then I'm like, okay. So we put the idea of we are both going to try songwriting and singing, not for any ideology of monetizing it, making it, just because we want to try it. Right. This is fun. Let's try this. And I suck. And I suddenly started to feel. Is like, can I really do this? I don't know if I can. What do I do? What am I supposed to sound like? Who am I as an artist? I felt like I kept trying to sing like other people. Yeah. It wasn't until Flash Club really? that I I realized I can develop a style yeah. from that song. Then when we did Nava, that was it. I was like, I have a style. I know exactly what my style is. I know exactly how I want to sound. And now every time I go into a studio, I go in there with so much confidence. I don't know what the fuck is going to be created, but I'm like, I know I'm going to create something good. Whereas before, I was like, I'm terrified. How do I want to sound? It's just insane, this journey. And now, because of Nava, not even because of Flash Fun. Flash Fun was like, this is fun. Yeah. And cool. I'm going to keep doing this for fun. If anyone likes it, they like it. That was it. After Nava, I was like, I'm coming in swinging. Yeah. I'm coming in swinging. I don't know where I came from, where this conference has come from, but I love it and it makes me so happy. And I just want to, I want people to feel this. Someone right. who counted herself out for years is going to do it. Right. You know what I mean? I'm yeah. Like, I'm going to do it. And I didn't, I didn't feel that until now. Wow. So like, now I'm like, I'm going to fucking do this. You know? <laughs> and now the new song coming soon. I'm a lot of excited. So much happening. Let's eat this food though, because we're talking way too much. Yeah, oh, and did something new come while we were Brussels sprouts? All right, we gotta dig into this Brussels action. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Do you like Brussels sprouts? Oh, yeah. Okay, good. Good stuff. Let's dig in. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ooh, wee. I ate everything. Everything. I didn't, I didn't leave a single thing off the plate. <laughs> really did. Oh, man. Ready to go? Let's go. Let's go, me, Byron. Let's go, me, Ryan. And have a quick meeting. You did. Heading to the pet house. So you're going to be mad at me because I couldn't bring the camera to this meeting. So you have no footage or any idea of what just happened. This was probably, I felt like I was in a movie scene, okay? I wish you were there. We were on the 17th floor, right look like, like facing the Hollywood sign in this meeting. And I'm over here like this. And I'm talking and everyone was just looking at me. It felt fake. It felt fake. I wish you guys were there. Just so I can look over at you guys and be like, but you weren't there. But I thought about you, which is why I'm doing this part of the video. Anyway, I'm home now. I'm having a bowl of cereal. It has been quite the day. Guess where we're going though? I'm gonna take a quick break and then we're going to the studio to create potentially another song or just to meet the people there and get to know and get ourselves acclimated to this new studio that we're gonna check out. I'm excited because this video is gonna end and that one's gonna go start. So when you're done, Go watch that one, and if it isn't out yet, you better put your, your post notification on. Because when that drops, you won't want to miss it. It could be another hit. But thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and leave some comments down below. I will see you on the next video. I am out. Peace.